Hello Star Wars collectors and welcome to another Bosk's Bounty video and this video is going to be a Star Wars haul video. I haven't done one of these in a while, I haven't really had too much come in in the way of packages from various retailers and what have you but I do have two here and this third one here which is actually a piece of fan mail which I have no idea what it is. It is from a Mark Karp, I want to say, all the way from the USA. As I say, I I was not contacted at all to say that this, this would be arriving, so I'm really intrigued to know what's inside it. So thank you very much, Mark. Uh, we'll open that one in a second. But I do have one from In Demand Toys and one from Comics and Cocktails. I believe these are going to be Vintage Collection and Black Series. So let's see what we've got. And uh, yeah, we'll start with these ones here. All right then, so let's start off the Star Wars unboxing stroke haul video. Let's do this one now. This one's the in, De in demand toys package. Hoping this is going to be uh, the latest vintage collection wave, but we'll have to wait and see because various pre orders you never know what's coming. So, there you go, there's a box within a box, which is always good. I like these shipper boxes because they're quite handy for keeping figures in. So just put that down there, right? So, what have we got here? Star Wars Vintage Collection Himalayas. So in the UK, they get solid cases of figures. But this is not a solid case, obviously. This is going to be a mixture. So there's some there. Look, let's see what we've got. We have the Battle Droid VC-78. Now, I do already have all of these figures when they originally came out, you know, on their original cards. Another VC-78 there. I've got two of each so I can review them for you. Uh, we have the Queen, uh, that's VC84. Another Queen, VC84. And then we have Peasant Anakin, or Anakin Skywalker in Peasant Disguise, which is VC32. I believe his poncho is quite new, different to the old one. So when I do all of these, I will be doing comparisons with the previous figures as well for you guys. Again, VC32. Now that is all that's in that package because they had sold out of the TIE Fighter Pilot when I placed my order. Um, I ordered placed this order pretty late and unfortunately they'd sold out of that one. So I grabbed those from Comics and Cocktails. So we'll see if those are in my comics and cocktails box right now along with some black series figures which i ordered so let's open that package right now let's bring it up here it's a slightly bigger box let's see what's in this one it's always good getting new stuff it's been a while it has been a while Yeah, right, I'm just going to move the box. So, first of all, in bubble wrap, we have two figures. Yep, and it's the TIE Fighter Pilot VC63. Now, I do know by looking at uh, some images that Bantha Skull put up that this figure, the paintwork, is much, much better than the original. So, I wasn't going to open one of these. I'm still not sure if I will. I'll see when I come to doing the actual review but um, yeah I, I do have one loose already you see so it's not like I need another one but it, it would be good to compare them so perhaps I will do that or maybe I'll just uh, line him up against the, the previous card back but apparently the paintwork is a load load better so that's those that's the uh, black series uh, sorry black series vintage collection figures all right then so also in here we have some Black Series figures. Let's see what this one is. Ah, okay, it's the Deluxe Jar Jar. I've been waiting for that. Um, yeah, so I don't really review Black Series really unless um, it's like an exclusive or something that's um, not widely available. You know, loads of people do reviews of the Black Series. I, I might start opening them up, but um, that's Jar Jar. We also have a Moff Gideon. So Jar Jar's number one in the Phantom Menace line. And then you've got uh, Moff Gideon, who's number eight. So there's been so many Mandalorian figures. Then we have Grief Karga, 
number six so of course as you know these these make a little picture as you go along and number seven which is the one i've been most looking forward to is quill and man i can't wait until they give us this guy in the vintage collection uh, looks pretty decent though black series so those three six seven and eight they go together like that so you can actually see the little picture that it makes which is uh, much better than those red red and black boxes i much prefer that so much better to you know present it like that or display it like that rather than your red and black boxes but um or you could get the figures out it's entirely up to you so they're the black series right so onto this parcel now from the usa this piece of fan mail to my po box which i have no idea what it is so this will be interesting there you go to the po box and mark carp k-a-r-p-f as i say i'm not really sure it says on the label there's a couple of action figures in here and some coins or something so this will be awesome so thank you mark if you do have like a, a name on youtube that i'm more familiar with which i probably am or instagram or something and you mentioned about sending me something as a gift then thank you and i do apologize that i don't recognize your your real name this will be awesome let's just get this uh, let's just get this paper off dorkside toys oh. all right let's get that paper off See if we open this box at the top now. There we go. Here you go. There's a note. It's always good to get a note because then we know what's what's going on. So it was sent on the 16th of December, so it's taken a while to get here. Uh, Bosk, Little Bosk, I'm sorry it's taken so long, but I finally got these in the mail. I hope Little Bosk enjoys the additions to his collection. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year from Mark. So thank you very much, Mark. I will have to get Little Bosk in here to take a look at what you've sent him. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. So thank you so much. Um, as I say, I, I don't know whether you've got like a YouTube name or an Instagram name that's different to your real name. I'll have to go through my messages. I get a lot of messages every day. So I do apologize if I um, can't find you on there to thank you personally. Uh, but let's get Little Bosk in here so you can take a look. All right, so I've got my son Little Bosk with me now. Obviously, he's excited. Um, so Mark sent you these. So what do you say to Mark? Thank you, Mark. Yeah. Right. So let's have a look in here. Oh, look. Some coins here. Are these 30th anniversary coins for your collection. You do like these coins. Let's have a look. Who have we got? Episode 3 Revenge of the Sith. Uh, I'm trying to see. That's Anakin, Obi. And that's grievous isn't it yeah what else have we got that's an airborne trooper and then oh that's the same one i do believe episode three and the same again awesome three coins for your collection that's brilliant thank you mark right let's have a look let's look really nicely packaged Oh, here we go. Look, I'm going to have to try and move this box a little bit. So we have got the Geonosian Warrior. Awesome. So there's him and he comes with one of these Massif dogs like the uh, Sand Trooper did. So he's off that card there. So there you go, little boss. What do you say? 
Thank you. You like those? They're cool. At the moment, I'm trying to collect all the Geonosis figures. Yeah, it's weird that this arrived uh, at this time because he's just watched Attack of the Clones and he's well into that arena scene and he's asked me to get him that thing with the horns and all that kind of stuff. So um, they'll go very nicely in the collection. So thank you so much for that, Mark. What else have we got in here? Oh, look. I remember now. I remember now. I do remember now. You see, this is, was so long ago because obviously it's taken a while to get here. But Mark was the guy that said he was going to send you Ephant Mon for your, for your Jabba's Palace. That is awesome. Look. Hang on a second. Let's get all the pieces out for you. There you go, his little knife with his walking stick, which you can make into another weapon. So let's just move this box. So there we go, Ephant Mon. You can just put that in there like that. What do you say, little boss? What do you say to Mark? Thank you. He is over the moon with this, really is, because as I say, when I open this guy, he keeps, he kept saying to me, can I have that one for my Jabba's Palace? And of course, you know, it's quite an expensive figure. So we are really, really appreciative of that, Mark. So thank you so much. I know little Bosk is going to be uh, setting this guy up right now um, in his, in his uh, Jabba's Palace. So there you go then, guys. That has been the Star Wars haul today. We've got uh, some deliveries from some of the retailers here in the UK. We've got some Black Series figures. We've got some vintage collection figures, which I will be reviewing over the next few days for you guys. And a lovely present from Mark in the USA to Little Bosk for his collection. They have two great figures. So thank you so much, my friend. I do appreciate that. We always appreciate any gifts we get. So thank you so much. Uh, little boss, do you want to say thank you once more before we go? Thank you. All right then. So thank you very much for watching, guys. Here he is one more time, Efant Mon. Yep. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and uh, we'll see you on the next one with the reviews.